Hey guys, okay, so today's all body weight. I am going to use my plyo box, but you can certainly do this without any raised surface, or if you have a stable chair, you can use that. Um, I'm also going to use an exercise mat, but if you have a cushioned floor, you don't even need that. So we're working on 40-10, I'm sorry, 40-20. 40 seconds will be the exercise on the list. 20 seconds follows every exercise with plank, simple plank, or if you want to do it a little more advanced, I'm going to show you what I like to call plank dance, okay? So you get a choice. Your 20 second interval, you can either just hold regular plank on your elbows, on your hands, or you can do the plank dance, which I'll do a couple times just to give you an idea of what that is, okay? You ready? We're doing mostly legs and abs today. So, uh, and we've just got 10 minutes, no rest, 40, 20, and we're going to start with the exercise, dynamic squats. All right, I'm going to start the timer, and three, two, one, are you ready? Here we go. All right. So you're sinking down, jump your feet together, jump it out and down. Make sure when you're going down that your weight is in your heels. Show your profile. Weight in your heels, sinking it back, keeping your chest high, your face is showing, you're not bending down like this. You're sinking down into the heels. Push off the heels, squeeze the tush at the top. Down. 13 seconds left, and then we're going straight down into plank. If you want to make this more advanced, you can hold weights in your hand or you can hold a medicine ball. Okay, going down into plank. I'm going to choose on my elbows today. Here's your regular plank. You want a nice straight body line from your ears down to your heels. If you want to do the plank dance, you just take one toe over to opposite heel and back and forth. Like that. Second exercise, plyo box, up and over. You're gonna step, launch up, come to the other side. Launch up, other side. Same thing, you're pushing into the heel always. Breathe. Like I said, you can do this on a chair, anything that's stable. And if you don't have a plyo box, the second time through I'll show you what to do with that. The idea here is to get your knee higher than your hip. Okay, back down. And hold plank. Do a little dance. Keep a nice straight body line. Don't let the hips rise into the air. Breathe. Put half pipe toe taps. You're gonna come onto your back. Legs come high. Reach up, tap the toe and down. These are all kind of fun exercises if you let them be. So this will go by really fast. To make this one more advanced, you can certainly add your medicine ball. You could add a dumbbell to your hands. Breathe. Flip it over, hold plank, do a little dance. If you're not quite ready for the dance, just hold regular plank. Abs held in nice and tight, nice straight body line. Oh, we're going in the straight, straight into Superman or Superwoman. You're going to lift your chest. Lift your thighs off the mat, reach up, and control it down. Control it up, control it down. You're working your lumbar spine area of your back. You're working your upper glutes, and down. And don't worry if you can't lift your chest up as high as I can, or you just feel that you're not quite getting the arc that I'm getting. It's all a progression, just do your best. Here we go, back up. I think I'm gonna dance every time, it's quite fun. Makes the plank 
just a little more interesting, makes it go by faster. <sighs> Certainly doesn't make it easier, I'll tell you that. <sighs> Next, we're going into yoga bikes, so you're just gonna flip over. Flip! <sighs> Make sure that one leg is reaching <sighs> straight and that you are crossing lifting with your shoulder don't just yank on your head make sure you are turning your body turn turn reaching with your shoulder if you do these right they really get those abs burning notice i'm not pulling on my head at all i'm just putting my arms here to twist my body Back to plank. We're just gonna hold plank this time. <laughs> okay, so we've done already one ton through. At the end of this bell, it'll be five minutes and we're halfway through. Back up to dynamic squats. If you're not ready for dynamic squats, just do air squats. Go all the way down, squeeze up at the top, sink down. When you bring it up, you wanna rotate your pelvis forward and really squeeze the hips and back down, okay? Dynamic squats. Here we go. My shoes are making funny noises. Sometimes I don't wear socks on my shoes and they make funny noises. Squish, squish, squish. Here we go. Down you go. Let's dance it. Dance. Beautiful pile, pile up and over. Oh, I thought I, I told you I'd show you. Okay, so if you don't have the plyo, you go down, press it up, down. Press it up, down, press it up, down. So you wanna get your knee higher than your hip, okay? It really engages your hamstring and your glute when you get a big step like that. Awesome. Going straight down. Up you go. Hold it nice. Nice straight body line. Breathe. What do we have then? Pike toe taps. Here we go. Toe tap. Down. As you're on your way down, make sure you're rolling your spine. So you're rolling up, rolling down. You don't want to bring it up and then just boom, slam yourself down, okay? Make sure it's nice and controlled. You're working kind of mobility of your spine, range of motion in your spine. Nice done, keep going. Nice, here we go. It's just 10 minutes and I'm sweating already. It's wonderful. With these 10 minute ones and you don't have a rest, they become still quite serious. Okay, Superman. Lift it up tall, control it down. And again, just like with the, when you're rolling up and rolling down, you don't want a jerking movement, you want to Bring it up controlled, bring it down, because if you just kind of throw it up like that, you can pinch your back. Make sure, controlled up, controlled down. Breathe. Breathe. Woo! Oh, we're down here already. Okay, I'm gonna dance it. 
going for the most advanced version, but it is up to you. Maybe you'll do it this time in regular plank and the next time you add the dance. You go guys. Reach that toe nice and straight. Really lift that shoulder and get that cross crunch. I'm not even pulling on my head at all. I'm just putting my hands there. Oh, my upper abs are burning. Ooh. When you can get a sweat, oh, when you can get a sweat in just 10 minutes, it's, you know, it's good. We're just holding plank now. This is the last 20 seconds, guys. This is it. Breathe, and you've done your 10 minutes. Hold it strong till the end. Activity completed. Activity completed. You got your 10 minutes body weight this week. See you tomorrow.